course you don't want to be that guy that I already showed you that do not know how to do a proper dumbbell seated hammer curl. So today I'm going to show you how to do it, how to be the most perfect possible when it comes to dumbbell hammer curls so you won't get injured in the long run. Before starting guys I would like to remind you to subscribe, to hit that like button, but also to hit the bell button for more tutorials, for more workouts, for more short videos, for more fun videos at the end of the day. So what I'm going to do today guys is I'm going to show you a step by step how to perfect, how to have a good form when doing the dumbbell hammer curls because at the end of the day remember that we do not want to get injured in the long run. I'm going to show you how. I'm so first of all as you can see I'm trying to stand uh, straight as much as possible as demonstrated uh, now I'm going to start uh, as you can see my elbows are quite on my sides they are not far apart from my body so I will perform uh, the best hammer curls possible and I keep as much as possible tension in my bicep muscles on the other hand this is what I usually see at the gym they swing a lot and they do not focus on their elbows to keep them on their sides this is another angle so you can understand uh, how to perform them you can see that I'm holding my back straight as much as possible and, and I'm not bending my back forward also this is what I usually see at the gym they do not focus to keep tension in their bicep muscles but rather to do the reps and get them done there it is guys, a full explanation how to do it, how to properly do it and I also pinpointed the mistakes that I usually see at the gym and uh, I have seen several times. Hope you liked it, if you liked it make sure to subscribe and hit that like button. Also until next time, enjoy and stay safe.